Hi Scorpio, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your weekly reading for February 26th through March 4th. Generally my readings are love readings, but the last few have not been. So we will see what comes up. They've been about finances or something else completely, so we'll see. It was a toss up as to who I was going to do next. I was going back and forth between Virgo, Cancer, Scorpio. One minute I was going to do Virgo, then it was Cancer, then it was Scorpio, then it was back to Cancer, and I'm doing you. <laughs> Interesting, huh? This is for Scorpio. There, we'll go with these. Oh, something's happening. And I mean happening, it's happening. Think something is really happening. It really, really is happening, okay? Something's happening fast. And I'm not sure what it is, but with the Knight of Swords right next to the Knight of Wands, something's happening, like, super quick. Like, super speed. Oh, shit. With the tower? <laughs> of course. I mean, what, what better words could I say? Those words were accurate. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, you know, that's the tower. I appear that it, it appears that something is coming in, and it is coming in very quickly. It's unexpected and probably not welcome. Okay. <laughs> doesn't make you happy okay it does not what something is happening super fast unexpectedly that that might rattle some heads oh my god now i don't know what this is but there could be a, uh, an end of a contract this could be at work this could be at home this could be between this is between two people there's some kind of ending in a contract Okay, whether, you know, you take it as it is. You know, this has been going on for a while. Something's been cooking behind the scenes. Something is not all as it seems. And you're about to find out exactly what it is. Okay, you're going to find out. Exact, some, there's something going on behind the scenes right now. And I'm telling you what, it's going to come out. And it might cause you, you know, you might... You might let go. It's time to let go of something. You know, this might cause you to struggle because this is uh, the hangman is a struggle. So, you know, it might cause you to see something completely differently as well. Something is going to happen that does not make you happy. And it's, it's definitely uh, some kind of secret is about to be revealed and it's not going to be pretty. You know, it's not, it's not. And the thing is, is you may have been waiting for this. You may have, and now's the time. There's no more waiting. <laughs> no more waiting. The time is now. So it appears to me that, or you could have been completely unprepared for it, okay? Because it can go, the, 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 this right here can go the other way. This could be completely un, unprepared because this is, and that's more like it to me. You know, you may have been prepared or you may not have, but I, for many of you, most of you, I think you're completely unprepared. You're about to have a shock, and when you are shocked, you are unprepared for it. So I, I feel as though there's something that is going to happen that is, is quite, quite uh, amazingly shocking, and you might not like it. Um, it might cost you some money, you know? I don't know. It might cost you some money. It might make you feel quite unpeaceful put it that way it's not going to be good i'm sorry i am son of a gun oh so yeah definitely not going to be good it's not okay you are about the shit is about to hit the fan and it ain't going to be pretty okay and whatever is happening you're dealing with somebody who could care less what happens to you so keep that in mind okay i'm just telling you just telling you what i see damn I can't, I can't make this up, okay? I, can't, I mean, I'm making it up as I go, but you know what I'm saying. I mean, the cards, they say it all. They're all right here, 
and any I mean anybody knows how to read tarot cards could tell you this is not pretty okay so something is going to happen that is somebody could get angry something might happen that makes you angry or somebody else angry and they retaliate I mean there's I'm telling you what uh, it isn't good I'm sorry um and you're probably not prepared for it, okay? You're not prepared for it. Um, it could cause, it's a break in a contract. And now this can, like I said, I mean, it could, it's going to come quite unexpectedly and it's going to happen just like that, okay? It ain't going to be, you aren't going to have time to think about it. It's just going to boom. It's going to be like lightning strikes and oh my God, what just happened? Okay. You know, like I said earlier, it could cost you some money. Whatever this is, it is, it's like, there's, you're not going to be satisfied with the outcome, okay? This is, there's some dissatisfaction. Maybe if it's not you, it's this person. Whoever you, somebody's not satisfied. Somebody's not happy. And they're going to, they're charging forward in your direction, okay? Um, and if they, like I said, this person could care less about your feelings. So trust me, they could care absolutely less about your feelings. And there's a, there's a feeling of somebody is feeling very unhappy, happy and probably overly emotional. There could be some anger and some bitterness and, you know, just be prepared. Jeez, some crow. Absolutely. You know, this is, this is you. You may, you may feel at this, when this happens, you might want to withdraw. You might want to get the hell out and say, you know what, I can't, I'm not, I'm, you know, and this might even cause you to be overly emotional, okay? Something, I, and don't be scared because you can handle it, but I'm just telling you, it feels as though something is going to happen that is overwhelming, okay? It's overwhelming for a minute, but it's not going to be a catastrophe, all right? So, you know, it's forcing change. It's for whatever's happening. Because that's what the tower is. The tower is a blessing in disguise. And here's the change. Something is happening to force change within your life. Okay? It's because things have been a little out of whack. And, they, and it, needs to, it needs to be dealt with. So I feel as though you have a change in direction right in front of you. The universe is here to help you with that. And you're going to, you know, you need to just go forward. You need to move on you need to move on from this blessing that comes in as a quite big shock okay so you know just it is it's removing something toxic instantly it's like an instant removal and that doesn't mean anything terrible bad i mean it doesn't look good i can't tell you that that it looks good but whatever happens is bringing you is forcing change that brings stability okay so trust me you're it's freeing yourself from some toxic false bond lie manipulation some kind of sabotage it's freeing you it's freeing you that's what's happening so trust me that everything happens for a reason you're definitely dealing with somebody who there's going to be some anger here there's going to be some anger Somebody, or definitely, I think it's anger. So, because we have the Queen of Swords twice. Uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. And then we have Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We also have the air, uh, fire signs, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. That's what I see so far. Um, it appears to me, and then we have uh, Capricorn right here. That's reversed. Something is going to happen that is very, very shocking that removes a false bond so that your life can change okay that's this is this is what's going on all right i feel like there's some kind of secret that is about to be revealed very harshly okay what or if it's not a secret from a person there's an event okay there's something that is going to happen that is going to cause some sort of shake up that is uh profound for some of you this will not resonate with every single person Okay, for some of you, there's going to be a profound event that changes your life for the better. And forces a new beginning. Okay? 
And don't take this card personally. It was on the bottom of the deck. I just happened to turn it over. This is a new beginning in life. Transformation. A blessing in disguise. Renewal. Release and rebirth. Whatever is happening is bringing you new life. Now I'm just going to get you one of these, as if you need to hear any more. Like I said, this will not resonate for every single person that watches it. And this is for Scorpio Sun. Don't comment underneath. Is this for Moon? Is this for Rising? No. This is for Scorpio Sun. Family. This situation is rooted in an emotional experience with a family member, which we can help you to understand and heal. Now, you notice it says emotional experience. All right, somebody is going to be emotional. All right, let me keep going. This situation is rooted in an emotional experience with a family member, which we can help you to understand and heal. In your mind and heart, surround this person, yourself, and the experience with calming blue light and many angels. Be open to the gifts within the situation and allow yourself to feel peace. I think at the, earlier I said lack of peace. That's funny. Oh, my God. Okay, so early, a minute ago I said to you this is for Scorpio Sun. And I know that Scorpio Rising and Moon are going to watch this, okay? I said that it was for, and the other ones can be for whatever you want. But in this case, this is such a strong reading, okay? I don't want you Scorpio Risings and you Scorpio Moons to be like, you think this is actually your reading. Okay, if it resonates, great. All right? This is a, this is a very strong message for somebody. And I tend to believe it's for somebody with Scorpio Sun, those words came out to my mouth for a reason. I haven't said that in any of my other readings. Those words came out of my mouth for a reason. This is for Scorpio Sun. Star sign. Sun sign, star sign. There's a transformation right in front of you that comes unexpectedly. Talk to you later.